In this lesson, we're going to take a look at the trim and extend commands to extend and trim geometry in our drawing. We'll begin by starting with the trim command and selecting the inside walls, the top of this retail structure. And then we can easily trim that geometry. The opposite of the trim command is the extend. Again, it works very similar. Here we're going to select the boundary edges and then imply a window to crossing select for the edges we want to extend. Returning to the trim now, we'll select the inside walls and trim the lines that are going between or across these hallways. Using the fence option, generally works best if entity snaps are turned off. Just draw the fence through the objects that you would like to trim. Now you'll notice the lines on between the doors did not trim. Next we're going to start the trim command and use all entities in the drawing as part of the trim boundaries. By pressing enter, BricsCAD will use all entities in calculating trim boundaries. Now we can select the lines inside the hallways and we can also clean up the space inside the doorways. Now that we've got that cleaned up, we can move to the lower right hand section and continue to trim away lines. Pressing the shift key while using the trim command changes the mode to extend. If using the extend command and you press the shift key, it will change the mode to trim. Next we'll take a look at our edge mode system variable and we'll use that option to extend geometry to a theoretical intersection. Beginning the extend command, going to select the extend boundary, this upper wall in the salon area, or select the edge mode and choose the extend option. Now we can extend those lines to the theoretical intersection of the selected boundary. This completes the lesson on trimming and extending objects in BricsCAD. Thank you.